let's download the MetaTrader platform for your PC, so Windows computer. Um, now, I don't have anyone in particular that is the best because people tend to ask you well, who is the best broker who is the best i don't have any of those things um i'll just tell you what i use um and then you can choose to to use those um if you wish um so i use brokers from europe um fxcm um oanda avatrade insta forex those are the four major brokers i use for my trading real accounts real trading accounts um and what i'll try to do now for some of our african nigerian clients is to give you an idea of who i use in nigeria so i have a, a um a trading account with insta forex in nigeria i've had these accounts with them for four years now since 2014 um, I've had no issues again that's just my experience I'm not doing it because I have any um, connection with them I just that service to me has been perfect I've had no concerns at all and the independent broker is known to me um, but nothing more than that so you can you can get forex brokers just go to google forex brokers and that takes you through a huge number of forex brokers that you can use so there are literally hundreds hundreds of them hundreds of them i will just go insta forex insta forex insta forex dot com dot ng insta forex dot com dot ng and all we're doing now is just downloading a metatrader 4 platform for demo account first we will talk about live accounts later but for demo account so what you want to do is just scroll down to the bottom and you can see here it says trading platform so this link here trading platform just go to it and so that gives us options and here I have download Windows MetaTrader 4 and so if I click that should then start the download process out here so once that is downloaded on your computer you can then click on it or wherever it's downloaded into your computer double click it click it open the, the installer and so this is the installer now yes i agree with all terms of this license agreement and then i can go okay now i can finish okay so once the download is complete you will get the platform open this way so what you want to do is to open a trading account remember demo we're looking for a demo trading account so we need to go to the server demo instaforex1demo.com and we want to go next you can either log into an existing account like the one you have on your phone by putting the login details and the password here remembering that the server must be the same if it's a demo account if it's not a demo account you need to move back and select um, a real server but now let's see how we can install a new demo account so new demo select that you go forward and then the account details go in and we simple again something similar so phone number account type standard deposit amount and leverage and i want to agree to subscribe to newsletter and all i need to do is just go finish and boom you can see my new account details have been opened so that's a login password investor password just take note of these because you might need them later 
okay and let's just go finish my relations on the update okay and that's it account is open now when you look just move this a bit so when you look now you can see the insta forex one demo and you can see that i have demo account setup now so that's the demo account setup just briefly nothing too in depth about how the platform works now the way you know that the platform is connected to the internet is when you look at this down right hand side corner you can see that it is connected if it's not this this will be pure red and um, you can see there are numbers here 30 390 um 394 those numbers will not be there if um if you're not connected to the internet right um and you this is self-explanatory there is so much information on the on youtube on um how to use metatrader 4 but i'm sure by the time we go through some of our lessons you'll be picking up how to to use it but clearly the new the first things to learn is these are charts so these are four different charts displayed on the on the on the screen we can maximize this to just have one chart at a time and you can see this tab here having four different tabs so four different charts yeah how can you add new charts you see that icon there create a new chart you can click on it and you can see all the currency pairs click on any of them and a new chart is created so let's go again forex major we can go create a usd card so boom and you can see now we have usd card on the charts by default it goes on the hour time frame but you also have these other time frames so you can change your time frame from one minute to five minutes to 15 minutes to 30 minutes to one hour to h44 hours to daily to weekly and to monthly yeah so those are your charts um you can also change these charts you can max you can zoom you can zoom in zoom out right now the chart has these bars these are called bars but you can change them to candlesticks and you can zoom in and these are candlesticks you can change to bars and you can also change to line i like to trade it candlesticks so how do you see other currency pairs and the price their price and um, there's something called the market watch so the market watch is this icon up here if you click on it or you can also see it in view and you can see market watch here so market watch and you can have all the currency pairs that you need to trade with currently this chart is usd card i can change it to gbp usd by click and drag it onto the chart and it will change the chart to gbp usd i can do the same again usd jpy drag drop and the same thing different time frames no problem at all right so that is the market watch you can also go if you want to see your account balance and what trades are open then what you need is what is called a terminal so the terminal the terminal is this icon here you can get it by going Control t or you can also go view and you can see terminal there boom that's terminal now we need to expand it a bit open it up a bit so with the terminal you have different tabs so with this mailbox you can see my account opening so i was welcomed by insta forex or by mt4 metatrader and then just telling me a few things about metatrader and then i can also go here and you can see my demo account opening and it has my my details here right john will tell you 
what's happening so it's a journal of all the things happening on the on the account experts will tell you things about where when you have indicators or robots on your chat it just gives you an up update on what's happening there code bases where you can is in the community so the mql for, for mql5 community people that have codes that can be used for trading you also have signals here you also have signals here you can also get access to the M metatrader mql5 community by going to market yeah so with alerts if you have alerts on your on your chart this is where they will display and any news in the market um, this is where you find them again you don't need some of these things just now the account history will have history of all the trades that have been taken on this account whether they are profits or profit or loss just has the history of all the all the trades that have been taken on the account this was your trade as a trade is all this also shows you how much risk how much exposure you have on your capital or your money um and then with this this is where you have open trades displayed as it were so these are basically what you need right now to start trading you know um and i hope it does help it does help um, but if you have any questions do come back to me and um, we'll pick it up all right see you soon cheers